hi guys if you are getting this error uh, let's fix this error if you're getting this error in Chrome it's very easy what you have to do is to just press Windows and R key together on your keyboard and then write inetcpl dot cpl okay just click on OK now once you're here just click on advanced and now click on reset and now just check this delete personal settings okay and now click on reset and close this window and try again and your problem will get fixed if this does not fixes your problem there is one more thing which you can do just press the windows and R key together again and now type ncpa.cpl okay click on okay now here uh, just locate your ethernet with which you are connected to the internet in my case I am connected by the ethernet yours uh, case maybe through the Wi-Fi so just right click on ethernet or Wi-Fi whichever you are connected to the internet and click on properties now just select internet protocol version 4 TCP IPv4 now click on properties and now select this use the following DNS server address okay now type 8888 and 8844 as the you know DNS settings now click on OK and close the window and now try again and your problem will get fixed if this also does not fixes your problem there is one more thing which you can do and that surely helps most of the persons facing this kind of problem is just search CMD in the Windows 10 search box right click on the command prompt and click on run as administrator now once the command prompt windows opens up you have to run these four command one by one uh, these three commands one by one okay I have pasted this command in the description of the video given below you can directly copy it from there and now just paste this command IP configure in new IP configure is to DNS okay this also does not fixes your problem there is one more method which you can try just open Chrome and then just write Chrome slash restart okay and now it will restart your Chrome and now try again and most probably this fixes the problem if this does not fixes your problem there is one more thing which you can check just click on start button click on gear shift icon and now just click on time and language and make sure that this is turned on and make sure your time zone are correct and time is correct if it is not then just change it and correct it so that's it guys please do like the video to support us and thanks for watching the geek page